So the purpose of my project was um, to design and construct an observation drone aircraft for flight on Mars. James Fagan is a 10-year-old student who attends Riverside Virtual School. He's currently entering the seventh grade and he's working on a project for creating a drone that can fly on, on Mars. When he describes this wind tunnel. So I built the horizontal lift wind tunnel to measure the lift generated on 18 airfoils of different geometric shapes and contours to say the different aerodynamic concepts that I've learned. I have no clue as to how, what it even looks like and how someone his age and his grade can even comprehend something of that level because I can't. He won sweepstakes in two different uh, at two different regional science fairs, and he had the opportunity to compete at the national level for Broadcom Masters. He, in my opinion, I think he shows a lot of dedication. To his project and I think he really shows the passion that these judges look at. Well I didn't tell them that I was inspired by their works and I hope and I want to get some pointers from them so that way I can improve my own experiments. Having a drone fly over our house to get some pictures and, and that's what sparked it. It's true, relative airflow. It presents a resistance. It's impressive. Yeah? Yeah. At this school, we can personalize the instruction specifically for him. So instead of putting him into a box, instead we're saying, we're going to put you in the classes that you need. So if you need math too, as you know, then we'll put you ahead. The secondary school really gives me a lot of opportunities. If I want, for example, I could choose in science to pursue aerodynamics. There's times where he just gets to where he wants to do his science. And we talked about this whole idea that we can personalize the instruction specifically for him. Yeah, it, it gives him flexibility to work his own pace and, and I try not to stifle that. And now this is the place that he has found to be really a successful place for him because now he can really pursue his passion for, I guess, wing design on Mars and still complete all the classes that he needs to complete. I wish to send my research to NASA to help them and aid them with the design for an observation drone aircraft. Maybe he can, you know, solve one of our next world problems. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> <laughs>